Over the years, the mystery of the Devil's Kettle has fascinated visitors to Judge C.R. Magny State Park in Minnesota. At this spot, the Brule River splits in two upon hitting a large rock formation. While one part of the river flows over a 50-foot waterfall and continues its course toward Lake Superior, the other half flows into a deep hole in the rock and mysteriously vanishes. For decades, people threw objects like sticks, ping pong balls, and even dies into the hole, hoping to see them reappear somewhere downstream, but they never did. This fueled the legend that the water disappeared into a bottomless, subterranean tunnel. The lack of a visible trace led to theories about a cave or an underground river connecting to Lake Superior. Even though the area's geology, composed of hard rock like basalt and rhyolite, is not conducive to forming large underground channels, State scientists and geologists were equally baffled because, while physics suggested the water had to reappear somewhere, tests with objects and dyes repeatedly failed. This kept the enigma alive, with thousands of people visiting the site annually to marvel at the phenomenon. However, the mystery was finally solved in 2017 by hydrologists from the Minnesota Department of Natural Resources. Using a simple method of measuring water flow, they compared the volume of water flowing above the falls with the volume below. They discovered that the volume was almost identical. The conclusion was that the water entering the Devil's Kettle simply rejoins the main river through a subterranean connection just a few hundred feet away. As for why objects don't resurface, scientists explained that the force of the water inside the hole is so powerful that it either destroys them or keeps them submerged until they reappear much later and farther. Downstream, 